that's the horn? <laughs> You're that Bumgarner tire and wheel. We treat you well. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean you didn't do anything? She's got a little rubbing, that's all. Hey! The guy. Yeah, this one's cool, dude. <laughs> is this segway super scooter what the hell is this guy buying i never understand it all right we need some drift wheels on the gloria so these nexons gotta get in there along with the wheels that came on the gloria they're like some three-piece 17 inch ball tire looking ass i don't know let's see if we can the gloria is bigger than the jetta so in theory and the wheels are smaller we're putting 19s and 305s in the jetta now we're putting 17s and 215s and should this should be a cakewalk this is the driver's side all right okay huh? now you might be asking dakota why are, why are you loading up alex's tires and to that i would answer i don't know where's the trunk release on this bitch that's the hood release where's the trunk I gotta find the keys for the Gloria. There we go. Also, what's really weird about this car, there's the door lock, unlock, one button. There's just one button. Wow. It's like meant for a set of four tires. I just want you to get on this thing and try it. <laughs> this That's all I want you to do. Is a Segway Super Scooter. Super Scooter. GT2. I would like to race you, Dakota, your Grom all against right. my scooter. I'm down. And just see what will take. You know that this is now your most reliable form of transportation? Like legitimately though. <laughs> Nick, look how this girthy is. that is. This is a whole ass motorcycle. We have to jump it. Yeah, take it to the skate park. Yeah! Dude, can you ride two up on that? Dude, it looks that way. It's so wide. <laughs> That's not legal for sidewalks. Dude. That's huge. Bro, who is buying this stuff? The military? How, what's the retail on one of these? You can pick up one of these on sale right now for approximately $3,299. Oh my God. That's the horn? <laughs> Is it in two wheel drive? Yeah. Well, that's probably why. I bet it can't be in two wheel drive. Oh. Got it all day, baby. We're here at the number one spot if you're in the Fox Valley area to get your tires and wheels balanced only because they put up with my shit, and that's bomb guards. I don't know about other people getting their wheels scratched, it's never happened to me. Yeah, I don't know any other place that let three hot big boys roll in with full <laughs> wheel tires. <16 laughs> That's the guy! Hey, That's hey, the guy! Hey. <laughs> That's the guy! How's it going, dude? It's dragging. What's up, bro? What's up, so, great news. There's not much. There's no, there's not a lot. Much. We have three Would cars like full. Us? So, we got the Gloria, the Jetta, and the 240 oh full of shit. <laughs> dude, they got in. They gotta come out! you want mounting your stuff right there. You're that bum guard tire and wheel. We treat you well. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. All right, so what do we got? Everything. Set of tires. Set. set of other tires. Set of the third set of tires. General G-Max RSs, first time running those. Apex forged wheels. Bunch of Nexons, like a million Nexons. Yeah, hell yeah. Nexon SU1s, baby. I don't know nothing about that. <laughs> 
All right, so we got the tires dropped off with the wheels over at Baumgart. Shout out to Nick and Baumgarts because those guys always take care of us. We dropped off a literal mountain of wheels and tires um, and appreciate those guys. They always hook it up and take care of the stuff when they're mounting and that is so appreciated because there's some shops that just do like OEM wheels and they do not care and they just slap stuff on and ding your wheels up. These guys actually care about it. That's why we always go to Nick. Uh, he's good shit. But now I feel like I'm betraying you guys a little bit, but Taco Bell has let me down a lot and I've just started kind of going to Taco John's a lot more. Also, shout out, God damn, look at that beast. You got the goods? I got, I got something for you though. Okay. I need you to put this in one of your broken ass cup holders. because this. They're not broken. Any. It's fine. Look, look. I'm a rock star in real life. We was doing Grand Theft Autos, hitting lakes, home invasions. It was a good night. Take the goods to the plug, then he bring us back by 2K. Feeling like a ball of seed of Jordan on my shoelace. What are we doing? So we gotta get a drain pan because Alex doesn't have a drain pan. Uh, and then we gotta get some more gallons of distilled water because we gotta swap out the coolant in this thing, that thing, and that thing for water. Because we gotta swap out for water because the track doesn't allow coolant in the systems during the summer. So I never realized the Z is blarg color. That's just Blard car 2.0 for real. All right. And this thing car. is almost empty. Every time I get in one of his cars, it is just out of gas. I don't. You realize the registration on the temp tags has 2022 also. Yeah. <laughs> How fast does that thing go? Oh my God. Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> Did you get race mode on me? Dude, that All right, you guys have fun. All right, you go get a helmet. And maybe yeah. some wrist pads, knee pads. Do you think, like, can you get pulled over on this? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, oh, he's gone. <laughs> he's legit fucking gone. Literally speeding on this <laughs> Okay, we're at the ketchup and mustard store. All right, what did we get, Joe? <laughs> ketchup and mustard store. We got a plastic tub that was $50 for some reason. I don't know why this shit's so expensive, but it is. Uh, and then we got a bottle of water wetter. That was all I had. Well, need more wet water, water wet, wetter. Water, Selling water, off the shelves like water. crazy. That's what I'm saying. All right, we got distilled water because you don't want water that moves around. You want distilled water. <laughs> 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 okay, now you gotta take that tray up. I'm not taking that tray up. You told me that you were having a hernia by getting the one. bottom one off, and then I got the bottom one off, and now you want the next one to come up. See, he's in a way better mood after you're riding the scooter. Yeah, yeah. Dude, yeah. I Automatic pick me up when I you're on love. the Scoot Scoot GT2 Segway. I love the Segway GT2. GT2. <laughs> Buy one. Not sponsored. Not sponsored. <laughs> they didn't pay me. They didn't send me one. This thing a big boy. That'd be, that'd be so, so crazy if they saw this and wanted to send me one though. That'd be Dude, that'd, that'd be, be insane if they sent me one too, dude. <laughs> well, take your hand out. No. Tell me about this funny looking funnel. So this funny looking funnel is a lifesaver. If you ever have to do anything with like filling coolant or doing anything with the radiator, go get one of these. It's gonna save you a freaking headache and it's a lot less of a mess to clean up. So but basically why? you get these little adapters that will go into like your radiator cap or like your fill spot. Um, so it comes with a bunch of different ones. This is the one that fits this. So you can lock her down and then this goes in the tap. Like, huh? And then you fill it up with your coolant or your water and then like you let it run, you let it air, like get all the air out of the system. It'll bubble up. Once it stops bubbling, if you got extra water or coolant in there, the normal funnel, you take it out, spill stuff everywhere. This one got a little stopper. Go. <laughs> what did you do? I didn't do anything. It's what do you mean you didn't do anything? Piece of shit. What do you mean you didn't do anything? Containers that they sell at fucking AutoZone. I imagine this is what BP felt like. <laughs> Same, but different. Same energy. But you're the one that dropped it on the f floor. I didn't drop shit. Yes, you did. I saw you. I have it filmed. This is a nightmare. All we had to do was drain the coolant. Why is there oil everywhere? Bless you. Thank you. 
Now GRU6 gets a little drink. Are you thirsty? You thirsty? You like the bread, little birdie? Oh yeah, water! Oh, this is acid! All right, fire up! I'm a fire in my GRU6! <laughs> Stop. Whoa. Stop. Alright. Next. Alright, so the Neon Evangelion car is here. Gels, what are we... What's going on? What you, you see how, like, we had to remove half the car to get tears? Yeah, mine yeah, 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 mine yeah. just automatically has nothing. So, like, Where'd your bumper go? Uh... <laughs> I think it's over by the Z. We were gonna do a front swap. Oh, yeah, we are gonna do a quick swap. Yeah. Yeah, give this thing, give this thing some some real sauce. Wow. Yeah, that's way better. Gels, confidently speaking, how many colors is your 240? Like extra, like body panel wise? Yes. I think three. That's like pro spec level. I know, color. right? Drink up, baby girl. I'm just trying to figure out which part of this is fun. None of it, none of it is fun. It all sucks. <laughs> Like it's just boiling, it's not even, you know what I mean? Man, yeah, it's a little bit like my chicken ramen. But guys, this is the one that we actually need to focus on. I haven't checked anything on this car since its last drift day. In fact, I don't think I've driven it since the last drift day. So we're gonna get it up in the air. We're gonna get the wheels and tires switched out. We got some Nexon tires. We got some actual drift tires. And it may not be a bad idea to check to make sure all the S chassis under components that we swapped on here with Driver Motorsport are still in like the same spot. Jaws, you have a 240? Yeah. Help. All right. Yeah. All right, let's go to Ace Hardware to get the basic essentials. Not Napa? Shopping spree! Ace is a place with the helpful hardware, Bob. One thing. I get one thing under $50 is what you told me. Yo, Alex, come here. They got JDM Beetle stuff. <laughs> Why are you the way that you are? <laughs> I know what I want. What? Yeah, this looks cool, dude. Oh, that's a lot of. <laughs> Woo! Oh, brother! She's got a little rubbing, that's all. That's not rub. Oh got... my god! He's ignoring it. I'm ignoring it. Okay, so we got the front wheels off. If you can tell, we got a slight potential issue here, but that's fine. We'll probably just switch them out on the other side because that'll fix the problem. But we do have the drift wheels that uh, we're ready to get on here. So, they're small boys. They're just 17s, square. I hate doing this. I just want the car to be done. Nobody's getting these kinds of shots. You're right, no one is. <laughs> that ain't going anywhere. Yeah. Oh my God, why is it doing that? Why is it doing that? I do that when I pee a little bit too. Drain coolant, add coolant. <laughs> there you go. Yes. It's chuggy hugging. Don't do that. Don't do that face, by the way. That was my bad. <laughs> Caught you in 4K, bud. <laughs> no one's getting these shots. Put it in. I did it. Now turn the key. Let's roll it away! <laughs> these are the signs of a, a man that works with his hands. A man that sweats and judges not by the sweat of his brow, but the sweat on a man's back. Right, Gels? Sweat on my nuts. 
It's been a great day. Uh, the weather's been beautiful. Working on car is not that exciting, but it is ready for drift day, which means you guys are gonna come along with us for the second drift day with the Nissan Gloria and of course, the Torque Motorsport GR86. So we're gonna see how it goes. You guys are gonna wanna subscribe, and if you wanna see us do anything wild with the Gloria, let us know below. I know these wheels are a little bit funky going from 1970s, but in all honesty, it doesn't fucking matter. What matters is we've got a set of drift tires. I'm happy. Thank you, Nexon. See you later, goodbye. Hey!